In this video I'm going to show you what might be the new best way to stream straight from your console to Twitch. If you've seen any of my videos before you know I've shown a couple different ways to improve your stream that come straight from your console, but this one is just next level and it's super simple. My channel focuses almost completely on just budget streaming, free ways to improve your channel graphics and other things like that. So if you're a small streamer and want to join this community, be sure and subscribe, turn on notifications for the occasional live stream. But let's go ahead and talk about today's method of how to improve your console stream. It's all done through a website called Lightstream and it takes your Twitch stream from your console and kind of intercepts it letting you add stream labs, stream elements, overlays, webcams, whatever you want, even different scenes. And all you have to do is change one little setting on your console and of course then go on their website and set up whatever overlays you want. But it's super simple so let's get right in how to do it and how it works. First I'm going to link these videos down in the description straight from Lightstream. It shows you how to go into your PS4 and Xbox settings and change your DNS. I'm not going to go into what all that means but that's the secret behind this website. Somehow changing this setting lets their website get your stream and then send it back to Twitch. So now let's hop on the computer and I'll show you how to edit your stream. You're going to want to go to golightstream.com and once you're here you can come up to this big get started button. Lightstream Studio is going to be the one you want. Go ahead and click it. It helps if you're already logged into your Twitch because then it'll just ask you to authorize and you'll be logged in. If it asks you which platform you're streaming from, be sure and click Twitch for now. The team is working on a way to do it through YouTube, but for now Twitch is the only method. Then it'll ask you which platform you're streaming from, Xbox or PlayStation. Go ahead and select, mine's going to be PlayStation. Hold up, wait a minute. Now wait before you click off this video. Before you dislike and unsubscribe and just cancel me because you see money's involved. First thing I want to say is if you sign up now, it's completely free until July 22nd. And then after that, if you want to continue, you can go through these different options, pay more or pay less. And you can cancel anytime you want. You're not on a contract. There's no strings attached. You just go one month at a time. Hear me out. $8 is not a lot. And honestly... I'm not lying, I think this could be better than an Elgato setup. I've set up an Elgato before through my friend's PC and it is the biggest hassle trying to figure out audio and all these different things while using something like this is just gonna take your PS4 or your Xbox audio, your party chat's gonna work great and you can add stuff to it. And another argument is I know that y'all are eating out at least one time a month probably multiple times a month. I know some of y'all like me are smashing Chick-fil-A like every day. So just skip one of those going out to eat meals. Ask your mom, say, hey, I don't want McDonald's tomorrow. Can I just have this subscription to make my stream so much better? So I'm gonna switch over to my other account and show you what all comes with this and convince y'all that it is totally worth a simple little $8 a month. First thing I want to say about all this is once you go through all this and set it all up and get it set up, you know, just the way you like it, once you hit go live from your console, it's going to put this on your stream every time. So you'll only need your computer the first time you set it up to get logged in, to get your alerts and your overlay set up just how you like it. And then after that, it'll all be done for you and you won't need the computer anymore. And I think you can even like control it from your phone if you wanted to add different scenes. But let me show you what all this thing can do. So once you pick whichever subscription you want, again, $8 ain't gonna kill you and I'm about to blow your mind with what you can do with this software. It, it's seriously, it's unbelievable. So you can come over to layers, click this plus button. You're gonna want your console feed. Now that's probably already there, but if it's not, you can add it. This isn't really going to be a deep tutorial. This is just going to be showing off how cool this is. And it's going to make you guys throw $8 at this software so fast. So now you can add text, an image, a video clip, uh, your webcam, an extra audio source. Now this is really cool because it's going to get all of your PlayStation or Xbox audio, you know, like your party chat and stuff. But if you come in here and you add an extra audio source like a USB microphone or something like a blue snowball. You're going to be able to mute your headset from your console, you know, so you're not talking to your friends anymore, but you'll still be able to talk to your chat through your USB mic or whatever extra audio source you add here. 
And then of course down here you've got your third party stuff and this will be where you add Stream Elements, Stream Labs, or any of these, which I'm honestly not super familiar with, but it's awesome that they have all these different options. You know, you'll just select it, you can put it wherever you want. This will be like your follow alert, and then you just add your Streamlabs link. But I'm not gonna do a Streamlabs tutorial in this, of course. So just a quick few more examples of what you can do. So you can come in here and add an image. This would be your overlay. Of course, you could uh, upload an image, but if you've got a few in here that you can go ahead and use, like if you want to show that your stream is powered by Lightstream, you know, you can just throw one of these down here, maybe under your webcam or something. Come back up here, video clip, that's not what I meant. You can add video clip, that's really cool, but I wanted to add a camera. We'll add this one, it's not working, but you can have your webcam over here. You could add your alerts and put them wherever you want. Uh, let's add an image. How about this border for my webcam? Again, you can add whatever image you want, add your own images, but it's cool that it already comes with some. I like, let's see, I like this little simple one right here. Let's take our light stream tag and move it on top of our webcam. And we've got this simple little overlay down here and now we can add text. We can make it say, hey text, put your name down there. Let's make it like 25. Put that right there and then maybe add your Streamlabs, some alerts or some event list happening right here. Uh, you've got scenes, which is insane. I'm telling you, this is crazy. $8 a month, you can have all this without an Elgato or some $2,000 PC. Come over to this next scene. Let's add an image. Uh, you could design whatever you wanted or you can use this Be Right Back that they already have. Uh, thanks for watching. You've got a starting soon. So literally guys, you're hitting go live from your controller or from your Xbox or PlayStation. It's gonna go to this website and this website's gonna change what's being sent to Twitch. You can have this scene selected and that's what people are gonna see. You can actually hit this uh, arrow right here and see we're not live right now, but if we were, it would be giving us a preview of what's streaming and it would be streaming this. And you can see your chat here. You can switch when you're ready to your gameplay and it's gonna have all this set up. It beats probably all the other methods on my channel. This is definitely the coolest method I've seen. It's just great that it's not a crazy workaround or some hack you have to figure out and take a long time setting up. It's literally a website made for your console stream. And I know this is gonna help a lot of you guys out. I wanna thank Ryan from Lightstream for actually reaching out. I probably would've never found this website without him. And I love finding new ways to help you guys out, be able to help people have an awesome stream without a crazy expensive setup. And that's the whole goal behind this channel. So if this helped you out, be sure and leave a like. It helps the channel out a ton. Be sure and subscribe for more videos like this one. I appreciate each one of you guys, and I'll see you all in the next one. <coughs>